Welcome to Divine Bow Beginnings 93. This will be our butterfly effect. I've already pre shuffled the decks. Um, we used three decks. We used the butterfly, flower therapy, and magical messages from the fairies. So I'm going to do it a little different this time. We're going to do this reading from May 7th to May 16th. And I'm gonna leave them separate. I'm not for sure. If y'all if y'all um looked at the other ones and you like the way I do it on there, let me know. And then I'll just change it back. But I'm gonna do it separate. I'm gonna leave this deck right here. I'm gonna leave this deck right here. I'm gonna leave that deck right there. So this is what we should be working on, you guys. We're gonna go into what we should be working on. With a few flower therapy messages. And again, this is from May 7th. So we're going to go. Each card will be one day. Well, each card will be for that week. But um, mainly for that day. That will be things or maybe obstacles that you will be going through that day. But... This is again from the 7th to the 16th. So, the first card is body changes. Going through some body changes. Maybe eating healthier. That could be great. The next thing is welcoming the new. Well, it says welcome the new, but I say welcoming the new. We're going into new things, maybe uh, new partnerships, new jobs. So congratulations. We've been doing the work and we're ready, honey. I'm going to just put this right here. Just make sure y'all can see that. Yes, you still can. Great. Okay. Let's get some more. Okay. We got get some rest. And we got new career. See? We are going into a beautiful new beginning. I'm still gonna scoot that over. Let's see. There we go. Good. Yeah, we still good. Okay. So it doesn't mean that this is like for a specific day. It's just, it means, okay, that one gets stuck to my hand. Spiritual growth. Here we go. It doesn't mean that these are for specific days. This is just for that time period from the 7th through the 16th. You can always come back to this video once you watch it and get done with it. Come back to the video. It may resonate in a different way. Or you may go through something you're like, hey... See, that, that's what the card said. We're, we're going to be going through that. Always keep a positive vibe, positive outlook, because what you put out in the universe is what you receive back. Trust me lately, you guys. I've been saying some smart things, and karma definitely was like, not today. <laughs> Got me right back instantly. Okay, so we have join in. Okay, come on. We also have new exercise program. That's good. We're going through these body changes, eating healthier. You know, not just for, everyone says that summer body, not just for the summer body. But just to feel better about ourselves, you know? Just to feel better, period. Make sure you get some rest. Because we definitely have rest here. Make sure you get the rest. We have religion and spirituality. Meditation is the best thing to do, you guys. To get closer to yourself. Definitely. Okay. Windfall. 
and hobbies. Do things you like to do. Do things that makes you happy. Let's go into our flower therapy. Okay, these two want to come out right away. Financial healing. Your money struggles are a thing of the past, honey. Be open to all avenues to receiving, and you'll be provided for in every way. We have patience. Yes, this is this is definitely coming up as far as like twin flames, soulmates. You know, y'all know. I I don't think I've told y'all guys how I feel about that. You know, but anyway, besides the point. In every situation, this has been coming up. Patience. You gotta have patience. Temperance. Hey. Okay, it says your prayers have been heard and they are being answered. Have patience. Have patience. They see you. They know what you want. Have patience with it. We have trust. You can trust the people around you. They are earth angels sent to give you a guidance. The guidance you seek. Great. I'm trying to fit everything. Okay. Cause it don't seem like I'm gonna have enough room. I'm just gonna have to overlap this. Okay, we should be good. And y'all can see it. Some of the butterflies you cannot see. But if you go back to the beginning of the video, you will be able to see them because I did have them moved over. Let's get one more for the flower. For the top row. Okay. We have be positive. Yes. Be positive. Your thoughts can shape your experiences. So be sure to focus on positivity. No negative. No negative energy this way. No feeding into that negative energy. Who wants to feed into negative energy? It just make you feel icky. Go take a shower. I don't know. But <laughs> don't feed into that. For what? All this is going to draw you down. Draw the person down. You ain't got time for that. You know, nobody got time for that. Next thing we got is balance, work, rest, and play. It's important for you to have fun along with fulfilling your responsibilities. Next one we have, simplify your life. You found, I mean, you've had so much going on that you're spread too thin. This has to change. Now, so vitally can read, so you can vitally recharge. Okay, great. I mean, one thing I say that will definitely help you is getting rid of the old, going into the new. Like, if you know you have clothes in your closet that you don't wear, you know, why are they there? They're just holding up space so the since they're holding up space, the new can't come in. Just, you know, go through your house. Be like, oh, I don't use that. Why is that even there? I don't even know what I do with that. I did that. I was like, look, I don't use them clothes. And then I thought about it. I said, but you know what? I don't use them clothes, but I can't repurpose them. You can repurpose anything. If you feel like you want to get rid of clothes that you can't fit, make sure they're washed, for one. Take them to the Goodwill. Other people can use them. Was your trash could be another person's treasure. Okay, let's keep going. Family harmony. Your loved ones form a strong parlor of support. Embrace their love and put past issues behind you. So, put things that happened in the past behind you. Okay. I mean, some people, let me say this. Put things that happened in the past behind you, but don't forget what happened to you. Because you'll be a fool to forget and then it happens again. Not saying that people can't change because people can't change. But 
go at it in a different way. Go at it like, okay, I'm giving this person a chance. A clean slate, but remember what happened. So don't put yourself in that state of, I'm going out on a limb again and they did the same thing they did last time and it happened all over again. Mm -mm. Set healthy boundaries. Healthy boundaries help you get through things. Healthy boundaries help you bring you closer to someone. You may not know why they did the things they did to you, but through you having healthy boundaries, it, it could it could show you why they did that. Or they could talk to you why they did that. Make sure you let somebody know if they're doing something that you don't like. Hey, I don't like how you stepped on my toe. It hurted me very much. And, you know, some people be like, oh, I'm sorry. I didn't, I didn't know I stepped on it. I'm so sorry. Or I didn't like how you, you misused my clothes. And when you gave them back, they were just like not clean. I had to wash them. And... If you're going to use it again, then can you please wash them? You know, something like that. Something so little. Be positive. Never be, well, I'm not saying never be negative, but don't be negative. Don't. If you come at somebody in a positive form and they just having a bad day, they may come back at you in a negative form. That may happen. But by you being positive, the way you enter this situation is the way the outcome will come. Some people... They just get angry and they don't understand why you coming at them that way. But in the same token, it's like, hey, hold on. I want to talk to you. I don't want to yell. I don't want to argue. I don't want to scream. But I would just like to let you know that I didn't like the way you mistreated something that I had. It's nothing wrong with talking. Talking is the key to getting through things. Maybe they didn't think you felt that way. So that's why the next time they did it again. No one is a mind reader. People can't read your mind. But if you speak of it and you speak on the situation, okay, next time I won't. Some people, they'll do it again next time and then at that point just be like, okay, I know you like to wear my clothes, but at this point, I don't, I, I don't want to give my clothes out to you. And then it'll make them think like, well, what did I do? Or they'll say you being stingy or whatever. It doesn't matter. That's your clothes. But if they keep mistreating things that you're doing, walk away. Positive. Positivity. Because you don't need negative things like that. Okay. I'm sorry, yeah, But I'm just really, like, just feeling it. And it's in the middle of the night. So I gotta, 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 I gotta kind of calm down. It's like 1 o'clock. So, sorry. But anyway, the next one is purification. By purifying your life of negative people, places, and experiences, you attain you at uh, la, la, you obtain true peace. <laughs> I guess I'm probably sleepy, but I'm just my energy. If you guys can feel my energy, put a thumbs up in the comments, please, or a heart. I like hearts. So put a purple heart in the comments if you can feel my energy on this video. I love you guys. Again, make sure you give this video a thumbs up. And, a, you know, if you're not subscribed, you better. <laughs> okay, the next card is New Idea. Your new idea is divinely guided and is meant to be shared with others. Continue to work on it as you can. Wait, as you are on the right path, guys. I mean, this week is going to be the bomb.com, okay? The next card. You are lovable. Love who you are. As you create perfectly. As you are created perfectly. Everything about your true self is beautiful. <laughs> you beautiful, baby. You shine bright like a diamond. Okay. I mean, you are who you are. Own it. No one else can be you but you. Okay. Let's get the next ones. Okay, we got emotional healing. 
As your heart heals of old emotional pain, you receive new blessings and love. Ooh. Make sure that's in the picture. It is. Let's keep going. Um, vegetarian. A new way of eating gives you more energy, greater health, clarity, and stronger manifest blah, 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 manifestation abilities. I've never got that card yet. And that is the perfect card. All of them are perfect cards. I don't mean, honestly. I know I'm tongue tied, a little sleepy. But I love doing this, you guys. This is like really my passion. Let's keep going. Admit your true feelings to yourself. Be honest with yourself. Only you know what it is that you truly desire. Okay, now. All right. <laughs> okay, let's keep going. Ask for what you want. Let the universe and other people know what you need. I had to learn that one, okay? I had to learn through my situation that I'm going through right now. I had to learn that I have to depend on other people to help me out. I was so used to... Doing things for myself, not really like having having to ask people for help. Like little things that we do every day, like putting on socks. You know, little small things. And I had to learn that I needed help. I couldn't do anything about it other than if I do it, I strain myself, I hurt myself even more. But if you have someone that's willing to help you get through the situation and as well as like just do it then why not ask for help they're asking you do you need help i'm pretty sure no one's gonna walk away if you ask for help well some may hey but i'm pretty sure you'll find someone else that can help you and i had to learn how to do that i had to learn how to let my ego lay down for some time and say look i need help i can't do it there's nothing wrong with saying i can't do it but any progression is a progression. We are here to grow. We are here to evolve. That's why my sign is called Bold Beginnings. Well, Divine Bold Beginnings because it's guided to us. It's guided to us to continue to grow. Every day is a new beginning. Every day you wake up, it's new. It's fresh. It's, let's see what I can do today to make today even a greater day than I made yesterday. Yeah, things happen. Okay, but in the same token of things happening, it's like tomorrow can be a better day. I failed today, but tomorrow I could be walking straight. You know what I mean? Like things like that. Like I stubbed my toe today. Ouch. Gosh darn it. But tomorrow I didn't stub my toe. I'm feeling pretty good. I still got a little pulse in my toe. You know what I mean? Things like that. Like. Look at the positive. It's always a positive to something. You, okay, I spent all my money. Oh my goodness. I spent all my money, but you know what? Tomorrow, I can make some more money. I'll go to work, or I'll do this to make some more money. Or not even that. I got the things that I need. So, I'm not out of money. I'm just doing the things I need to do. You know, look at things positive. Some people, like, I know when I was working, they constantly, constantly working, like, tiring myself out, doing overtime. When I was doing that, it was like, I truly, I truly like working. And when I was doing that, it was like, I was just getting the money, but I couldn't spend it because I was picking up so much overtime that I was at work all the time. So it was like what was the point because you're not living life you're just working live life a little go to the beach i love the water of course i'm a water sign too so but anyway i love the water i go to the beach sit there you know you can get in the water sometimes you can't you know what i mean but just enjoy life feel the breeze let the air roll on your skin you know Drink a cold glass of water. Drink a warm glass of water. Drink what you like to drink. I don't know. Just be grateful that 
you know, you have a chance to make your life better. You may feel like years ago you did this and that, or, you know, a few days ago you did this and that. Okay, that was a few days ago. Today is a new day. We're going to have a great day. Hey, you know, it's like, feel it. If you don't feel it, no one else will. And I was watching this video on YouTube. I forget the name. Oh, my goodness. Uh, if I if I go back in my history and I find it, I'll let you guys know. But she said, even when you feel it at your lowest, like you feel like crap, still get dressed, still look your gorgeous. If you put on makeup, put your whole makeup on and still go out and look good. Like you attract to you what you push off. You could be having a bad day, but you get up, you get dressed, you you looking gorgeous, honey. And you know, you you attract somebody. Somebody will make you smile. Somebody will be like, "You look very nice today." There's nothing wrong with paying people compliments, you know what I mean? Like who wants to walk around and be miserable and mean all day? That sucks. It really sucks. It takes more muscles to frown than it does to smile. So, I smile it up, honey. I'm sorry. I'm just talking, y'all. Let me keep going. Pregnancy. Ooh-wee. The birth of a, ch of a child brings great blessings to you in the world. Some of y'all pregnant? What? What? Or about to get pregnant, honey? I feel this card. Let's see. Affirmations. To lift up your thoughts and energy and to attract what you deserve, use positive affirmations. Part of affirmation is being positive for you, you know? Winter, the answers to your prayers and affirmations are fully recognized in the winter months. Hmm, hmm, let's see, let's keep going. Okay, your wish is granted. What you've asked for is coming true. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I just want you to know. Mm -mm. Okay, spring, you deserve, wait, your desires fully manifest as the flowers begin to bloom. Uh oh, uh oh. I'm doing too much. No, I'm sleepy. I should be asleep. Okay, last card. Healing, healed, and healer. Healing energy surrounds you in this situation. So, things is looking up, y'all. This was the Velvet Evolution Butterfly Effect. I hope you guys liked it. Again, these messages are for May 7th through May 16th. Again, I hope you guys liked it. If you haven't given this video a thumbs up yet, please give this video a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed to me, please subscribe to Divine Bowl Beginnings 93. I will see you guys in the next videos. Have a great day.